Hello, Scorpio. Happy birthday to all of you lovely, beautiful Scorpions. I hope you have had a great birthday. I hope you are having a great birthday. I hope you will have a great birthday. So for this week, for this coming week, I'm reading from the coffee cup and then I will be drawing out cards uh, towards the end. This is the Radiant Rider Weight Tarot deck. All right. <laughs> Let's see what we have for you, lovely scorpions. All right, scorpion, scorpion, scorpion. Da, 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 da. Something here about like you're plucked out from, you get seen, you're being seen, you get plucked out from a crowd of people by somebody. There is like a special energy here, you know, it's like, um. You could be applying for something and out of a thousand applicants you get picked. There's some kind of energy like, like that. You could be going to an audition out of so many you get picked. Or it could also be, you know, you're in a, like a big crowd of people and I see a special energy, special connection with somebody that they spot you from you know, uh, amongst the, the, the crowds. I don't know, I'm seeing something like that. It's very interesting. Pro probably not all of you, just some, but however, on, on the larger scale, you are being noticed. That's what I'm seeing for everybody. You are being noticed a lot more than usual. High, high energy. There's something, of, of, it's kind of an intense energy as well around you. Um, you know, you're turning heads, Scorpio. And I'm not just saying that because it's your birthday. <laughs> like, it's um, a lot of, ooh, you know, like highly attractive. All of that is coming through. I do see you're taking your saving, um, your savings a lot more seriously. You like you're really trying to build up on your savings. Um, and store that away and not even look at it. That's what I see. It's like maybe, maybe you're looking for, uh, you're looking at something long term, you know, and you just kind of want to focus on the now, the present, um, making sure that you're securing things for the future along the way also. So you're being very smart about this. Also, the, there's an, what I'm seeing here is that you're, you're not following others. You're very much your own individual person. You're not a sheep. So there's there's something here that it's like everybody's following, doing the same thing, but you kind of get deterred from that. You're like, no, actually, I don't know. I, I this is what I feel is right. This is what I'm going to do. What I'm going to make. Um, you know, and it, it's something creative, and it's something that kind of puts you on the map in many ways, you know. This is one of the other things that makes you be seen. Um, I do see you are caring for yourself a lot more. You are taking your um, health a lot more seriously, looking after everything, including your hair, all of that. It's like you're stepping up your game in terms of, um, you know, my body's my temple sort of thing. I do see somebody very wise around you that's going to give you advice that you're probably going to remember forever. Um, and it may change the way you look at things uh, and when you uh, decide on some important matters as well. Um, there is Scorpio, somebody around you, some, there's something that, that's a little bit obsessive around you, um, I do see you ready to kind of cut that cord because it's getting a bit much like, you know, everywhere you turn and, you know, it, and it's like, oh, let's hang out and, and it's like, I don't know, I see it's, it's too much, you need your own space and you do, you're going to let it be known uh, to this um, person um, but it's like you do it in a, in a, in a good way in a, in a clever way you know so they can like take the hint um, there is 
a fear of rejection. Out of everything I do see, there is some little thing here, little thing that you have in you, that there is a fear of rejection when it comes to, it, you know, um, being completely honest with how you feel towards somebody because perhaps the, you, the, there's that fear of rejection. It could be roles with us. But there's something there that it takes you a long time to really build trust and know whether, you know, it's the right thing and how much you can open up. And it does say the ball is in your court. So you can take as long as you want. You know best how you feel. And then there is... You have something stored away, and this could be something specific, something stored away that's very valuable, that's very like, um, anyways, I think this is something, I don't know, like it, it's, it's talking about conserving it. So if you have something valuable around you, just make sure it's in good condition, you're taking care of it and all of that, um, and, and then put it away somewhere secure and safe. Because I'm seeing something about, you know, there could be a possibility of damaging it or losing it or whatever. And that's something that you don't want to do. I know, random message, but it's there. All right. <laughs> Let's see what the cards have for you. Okay, Scorpio, 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 Scorpio. Mm, I see a lust around you. Like there's this lust. Somebody has lust. Queen of Pentacles. All right. Queen of Pentacles, Scorpio, Scorpio, Three of Pentacles, I love my Scorpions, do I take the, da, da, da? okay, Ooh. Knight of Cups and the Four of Pentacles, wow, okay, okay, look at this, taking the savings very seriously, Queen of Pentacles, you, you know, you want, Scorpio, you're going to do remarkably well just fine nothing to like i don't see you scrambling i don't you know none of that you've been very once you um focus on something once you really start on some project something that you know um in this case money you stick to that you know and you make sure that it is a success you're a lot better off than you realize um and here with the three of pentacles and the nine of cups there is like you as i was saying you are being seen you could be coming up for a promotion or there's just something that i also get you are able to tackle other things that others are not and that's also why you looked on favorably that's one reason um but your hard work is definitely you know um being noticed and i do see something about pay, pay attention to the signs pay attention to the details there's something with that that's coming through when you ask the universe for something it's going to send you signs um giving you the answers through that and we're here with the knight of cups and the four of pentacles you know i was talking about um so on both levels um, you, you're starting to kind of take money a little bit more seriously your savings and all of that and what you can do with it especially if things are arising or or you have a rise or you know that there's um i'm sorry if you can hear the sirens uh there is uh you know, halloween week who knows but anyway um night night of cups gives you what i see something that looks really good it looks really promising it's an offer here that you um are happy to take but very 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 careful like you're walking carefully um you know you're not splurging or anything like that and if it's somebody then you're taking your time you're not giving yourself away too quickly um again trust takes time with you to build um, a death card okay death card the five of pentacles death card and the five of pentacles there is something that i see again um 
Oh god, sorry about if you can hear those sirens suddenly. So we have a beginning, we have an ending to something that I see something to do with something that you aren't comfortable with, that you are now cutting cords with. So you can start a new beginning. When I was talking about the fear of rejection, that's what I'm getting here, but there's no more of that. Sometimes there, there needs to be something for you to, you know, you're not afraid to say no. Um, and no more kind of somebody taking your energy, you know, no, nobody kind of like, because um, I'm getting, I'm getting that there is somebody or something around you that just can really drain you and it's time to um take that step you know and and make the right changes because i was as i was seeing you have to look after yourself so here with the death card and five it's it's a transformation that i do see has been um a long time coming a long time coming but it's one that is needed to happen. So as this transformation happens, you will have to decide and, and, and take this course of action to release somebody um, from you, you know, uh, because, or a certain pattern, a certain, yeah, I, I get this history there. The Page of Cups, from the Knight of Cups, the Page of Cups, look at this, all pentacles, and two cups and of course we have death card very very interesting you see as you do this because you you're gonna you feel the transformation you see this you you can see like okay this is my start this is my new beginning and it is because it's your you know your new year in your life your birthday you're entering a new you know year in your life so you're making some some important decisions, important steps. Um, and and it could be that fear as we we're talking about, like what if you, you do this, then you won't you won't have what you thought you you know you won't have what you thought you were about to get, but you things work out a lot better than that. And with the page of cups, things start to come in. And I do get you're gonna be very, very happy with that as well. It is, you know, there's there's a lot of um, good luck around you. There is a lot more warm energy. No more of this being uh, feeling like you've been left out in the cold. There is more of this warmth. You know, you're attracting the right people, the right person, the right situations. You're at the right time, the right place. As I was saying, like you're being plucked out from a crowd. You do get seen, but you realize there's a few things that you need to shift and move out of your way. You know, and keep yourself protected also. So definitely whatever it is, and I do get you um, uh, responsible, being very, very responsible. You know, you're taking charge. There is something coming to you, uh, Scorpio, that you're going to be very pleased and glad with how things um, are coming about. Thank you so much, Scorpio, for being here. Truly hope that this was helpful. Please do let me know. I appreciate every single one of you. Please do take care. Happy birthday. I love you all. And until next time.